Royals, what's going on? It's your girl Q the Queen here, back with another video. And um, listen, I know it's been a little minute since we've done some early reviews, but not gonna lie, last few months, um, I, I just wasn't really feeling a lot of the releases that were coming out. Obviously the releases stay plentiful, so it's not that stuff doesn't come out, but you know, I, not everything that drops is something that I care enough about to kind of show you all and do the things, but I feel like October is coming different. I feel like October is coming different and we're about to hit the time of year where the releases are just going to be like up to par, up to par, they put it like that. And I'm talking across brands, but specifically our reviews focus more on, you know, Nike Jordan. Some things might be Adidas, but for the most part, yeah, we, we're going to focus in on kind of the heavy hitters for the rest of the year. So, but anyway, what I got for you. A lot of y'all looking to see these in hand, looking to get your opportunity to grab them. I have no doubts about them because I'm probably one of those people too. So let's get into it, man. Boom. You see the box, man. You see the box. I'll tell you one thing. When this box got pretty much brought over to me, I was very surprised because I was not expecting a graphic on this box. I'm gonna just put it like that. So that definitely created a little bit more excitement. I'm typically not one that care about a box. Let's just put it like that. I never really care about a box anyway. I will say, I do appreciate having a different box. Anyway, let's get into the deets. You see it. Air Jordan 1, high OG. Special graphics on the tissue paper as well. Look at it. Look at Jordan brand, okay. Okay, y'all making the excitement worth it. A little bit more graphics, a little bit of the throwback pictures that we know of from the 80s, um, and some conceptual photos as well. Looks like drawings, right? Some drawings, logo drawings, and just some OG pictures that most of us have seen in some respect um, just over the years, right? Let's get into it. It's upside down, but you get it. Let me, let me, let me switch this around. Here we go. <laughs> Now it's funny because when this shoe was first revealed to be a potential drop, it was a little bit of controversy, right? I'm gonna take both out, actually. Let me take both out. Before I get into it, inside of the box on the lid, you actually get that Wings logo there. Looks like a signature special attention M. Jordan. So this looks like probably either made up or an official sample that they sent to him for his review. Here it is. Here it is. We have not seen this retro since 2016. And um, it's a spin. It's a spin. It's a reimagined spin to it, right? So this is supposed to be what one of the samples were for the logo prior to them deciding on the Wings logo that we all know with the Air Jordan 1. So this was the controversial piece that a lot of folks felt like, oh man, okay, so y'all gonna retro this thing, but y'all not gonna retro it the way that we know it, okay? <laughs> you know, people do not like change, but the whole thing with Reimagine, they either gonna give us some sort of story about what the shoe could have been, or perhaps what they may have done differently or could have done differently. So in this respect, from my understanding, this was actually one of the sample pairs for the black toe. We get a release of it. Reimagine, baby. Black toe. Okay. So one of the things outright, I will say, in hand, um, in hand, it looks the way that we know it to look in terms of how it feels, though. Uh, nothing too crazy for the, for the quality control uh, squad. Nothing too crazy in terms of the leather, it's just a synthetic leather. Sometimes we find that the toe box will have a different texture, but to be honest, from what I'm feeling, it feels pretty much the same as the upper. So nothing too different around the shoe, not even um, the upper where the medial and lateral side go. Like there's no difference in, in how it feels. So we'll give it another once over so y'all can see that. But again, I am of the crowd that is more likely, more than likely gonna go ahead and go after them because I do not have a pair first and foremost. So that's the biggest piece for me. Um, you will notice though, that we got a double lace situation going on here. So let's see what type of lace action 
is available. So looks like they come tied up like inter intermingled, right? Same for the other side. So as opposed to having the cardboard box with the extra laces, you got both your black and red intermingled. So you can kind of see which way you want to go with it. As one that's not a big lace whopper, like this is useful. This is useful to me. Like, <laughs> so I'm with it. You got your normal red on the Nike Air on the tongue with the black foundation, black tongue. You got your red bottom, of course. The insole you can see is white with the black Nike Air logo. I'm trying to go after them. I remember the last drop vividly just because I started my channel in 2016 and I remember um, this being on the calendar and I, I'm not really sure how I maneuvered that year but I did not get them. I don't remember what my situation was but I didn't get them so definitely if I did have them I probably will pass, but because I don't have them, I'm going, I'm going. <laughs> October 18th is the day that these drop. So this is one of the, I would say probably the biggest October drop. So y'all let me know in the comment section if y'all own these or not. Like I said, I'm definitely gonna try to grab a pair um, because hey, listen, when it comes to like bread colorways and ones and black toe, bread toe, you know, I, I definitely, I have an appreciation for them and they hold up. Every ones hold up. So I like the classic colorway pair that I can just kind of wear if I want to be fly, if I want to be casual, if I want to be, if I just want to put on some kick arounds. I think they kick arounds too. They kick arounds too. So <laughs> just saying. So y'all let me know. Again, October 18th. Air Jordan 1, high OG, reimagined black toe. Yes, indeed. Hit that comment section. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Most importantly, let me know what y'all thinking. Are y'all pretty much planning for October to be these? Is this your October pickup? Let me know. <laughs> Until next time, royalty. <laughs> Hi!